As I was poking around in VCDS on our 2004 V10 Touareg, I noticed something interesting. V10 Touaregs have two batteries. There's one which lives under the driver's seat and another that lives in the back. In the spare tire well. And when I looked in VCDS, I noticed that this will focus. The uh, starter battery was always reporting no volts. So I thought that was kind of weird. So let's take a look and see if this battery is actually working. So after removing the spare tire to get at the battery, there are four uh, 10 millimeter nuts, a series of these little clips, and then this cover lifts off. And now we have the battery, the big solenoid that connects the two batteries, then there is another device down there. I don't know specifically what that does, but uh, I'll go ahead and hook my meters up now and show you how I tested this. So this meter is showing battery voltage and this one is showing the current going from this negative post to ground which actually connects right here. You can see the cable just comes off, goes around, and I've got a, uh, a clamp on that. So that we're effectively reading uh, no current coming from this battery in 12.6 volts, which is you know fine for a battery sitting at rest. So the first thing I did came around to the front and I turned the ignition on, turned on the headlights, turned on the high beams. Turn the fan up. So now we've got some load. And as you can see, we don't really have any current draw going on back here. The little 0.3 of an amp that it's measuring is just uh, a, a measurement error. So the next thing I did, I put this into min max mode. So that's going to show us the maximum current that goes through there. So now we can go back to the front. And start the, start the engine. And I don't know, you could hear relay back there going clunk, clunk. And if we look, that drew 311 amps while it was starting and the voltage is going up because the alternator is now charging this battery. So what I'm guessing is, I could find my flashlight, well anyway, there were these two units back here. I think this large one is the solenoid that connects this battery to the starter and the smaller one down there connects this battery to the front battery for charging purposes. So as far as I can tell, everything is working properly back here. We've got the battery charging. Even though if we look at VCDS, it's just showing, you know, nothing on the, uh, the start battery. So I guess that's just a measurement error in VCDS. Everything on the truck seems to be working fine. Now that does make me question one thing, because there's been twice now where I've been just checking things on the truck, leaving the ignition on, and after about an hour, it was so dead it wouldn't start. And I don't know if it's just not, it's the computer's getting confused and it's not pulling off of this battery then or what. Apparently, if you turn the ignition on and off twice, that puts it into emergency start mode, and then it, it should go. So if it happens again, I will try that. 
there's always um, a lot of little undocumented uh, tricks and procedures on on this truck. Definitely need to uh, RTFM. Well, anyway. That was a quick electrical diagnosis on a 2004 Touareg V10. Thanks for watching.